on Game Mod channels. The next earthquake, I will say thumbs up for Epic Earthquake. Why? Because I know y'all fucking hate it. That's why. You know what? It's my fucking business. It's my opinion. I'm yeah, I have a fucking soul, but I have fucking morals when it comes to shit that's fucking private. If I have an opinion about a fucking earthquake, then I'll say it. Don't fucking heart me over something like seven months old, fucker. There's an earthquake today, as a matter of I fact. Know, and, uh, guess what? There's there's a video probably being made about it anyway. So yeah, I'm it's sure people are, I'm sure people are making videos about it. Yeah, it's by Virginia. I saw my brother ran in here and told me about it. So my my dad I ran in here and told me about it. There's family. I have family in I have family in Richmond. Yeah, I went and told a few people about it. So. Yeah, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be crazy. But what I'm trying to say is, dude, you have no fucking right to talk about business, anyone, or anything else. It ain't your fucking business. Who the fuck is with who? It ain't your fucking business, dude. No, you cannot fucking talk about whatever the fuck you want if they don't want you talking. If they block you on one channel, y'all shut your fucking mouth and you don't go on another channel and start fucking sprouting, dumb fuck. That's what you're fucking wrong. You don't got freedom much when it comes to the block button, bitch. Nobody fucking cares. No, you have no fucking business harassing people. If I find out that you continue harassing people, I'm going to attack you with all the bots that I got. You understand me? I got a botnet in the UK of 20,000. Y'all fucking done. Chris. Yeah. Basically, this guy's an asshole, a motherfucking loser, who has no life that wants to pick on successful people. That's what this motherfucker is. And why y'all got contacts with this guy? I have no idea. I'm, I'm fine. But he's a him. fucking idiot, a scumbag, a loser on the bottom of a fucking empty barrel with shit in it. That guy's going down. And if I find out that you know who that is or that is you, because you're on my list, if that's you, I will. I don't, I don't, I don't think that's, I don't think that's physical him. Physical damage to the exposing activist in my lifetime. I will do physical damage. Yeah, it's not, it's not him. Because at one point I will gather, gather my money up. I will go and find out where this guy lives and I will fly over there and I will take a baseball bat and I'll crack his back give a fuck. You don't fuck with me like that. You don't fuck with my family like that. You don't fuck with anyone like that. See that? See that, Chris? I, I think, I'm not sure if he's... The exposing activist will be pleased here. Shut your fucking mouth. I give a fuck. Oh, I'd be walking out of his house every day. Wondering if I'm going to be around the corner. That's what I want. I want that motherfucker to be looking for me. I think he's, think he's being sarcastic. I'm not sure what to think right now. Right. Y'all keep up. I'm, I'm, conf I'm confused. I don't know. Y'all keep fucking with people on the internet. That's when it gets fucked. You think that this is just the fucking internet? Fuck you. Shut your fucking mouth about the T-word, bitch. Ain't no such thing as fucking threats when it comes to me, bitch. There's a fucking promise. So shut y'all fucking mouth. I 
I said that's a fucking promise. Listen, just don't fuck with people anymore on the internet, especially anyone who I know. You understand? What about DF? I know that you guys have a small circle, that you guys are a bunch of fucking circle jerkers, just you and a bunch of people. Y'all can fuck yourselves, though. Because put me in a fucking room with you guys and I beat the living fuck out of single one of you to the ground. You can't fucking take this. Are you kidding me? The guy like me who has a temper like me? You think you can take me? You think you can put me down? I said Arch and UTF were hypocrites because all they did was troll. Especially UTF. But he stopped it because that's why he uploaded the video that said he was done. Because him and I talked on Skype. Put a message to my Facebook and said, you know what? Everything that I said in there was a joke. None of, none of, not true, so you know, don't worry about it. The guy actually likes me. The guy doesn't care. But here's the thing. YouTube isn't about drama. Y'all understand that? Chicken, it's not about drama. There are some people who have careers in YouTube that like to do it. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Then understand it and don't fuck with people who don't want to hear about it. Do you understand? The sooner you understand that, then that's better off for you. Do you understand that? You'll start respecting yourself the sooner you understand that YouTube is a platform for a it's career like, and for income for a lot of people who are older than you. Do you understand that? Time equals... What is... Nobody tried to sell any channel, but my fucking gaming channel was hacked. Now, don't talk to me about the past. Don't talk to me about the past. It's already been said and done. I'm talking about now. I'm talking about things that you do now. Don't do it anymore. Don't fuck with people. I'm on not YouTube. even sure what's going on with. Don't mess with people it's, on YouTube. Yeah. Because YouTube is their business. I don't give a fuck. It's not free speech. That is their business. You don't walk into someone's job and start fucking talking to people. About them or to them or whatever. You don't do that. You do not walk into someone's job and try to fuck with them. Do you understand me? Well, you know what? It is now designed. Because some people take 12 fucking hours to a whole day on their videos or six hours. They don't work or they don't have a job or they lost their job and they are a partner. And when they waste time like that, that means that they should be getting paid. Especially if they like doing what they're doing. Do you understand that? I think that YouTube is more stable than an actual job because it, unless you, if you, it can be and it can't be at the I same time. Job. I agree. I have a job, Chris, you, and uh, not you, Chris. I have a job, where the fuck your name is? Arsenio. Arsenio, and it's none of your business. None. But it's a great job, and I'm going to continue with it. But it's none of your business. But other people don't need jobs. If they don't want a job, they don't have to have. If they have a source of income, they have a right to have that income. That's their income. If they work for it, it's their right. I don't see where. It's any of your business where you can deny someone the right to their income or to harass people when they're just don't even care. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what I want to say. What was that? Huh? I just heard something in the background. 
Oh, watching the video. Oh. Watching. Hey, what started? What started this whole thing? What? What did Arsenio do exactly? Um, he, Megan came up to me and he, she said that he harassing, keeps harassing her about stuff that's none of his business. So I'm coming to him because I heard about this happen a few days ago or a couple days ago. I'm coming to him telling him no more. And no, Google doesn't have the right to stop the income at all. Not just stop it. If it becomes a person's primary income by law, by U.S. law, they have no right to stop it. What they do have a right to do is see what violated, though, their terms of services and use that against the said person to stop that. What I violated was I paid for promotions to thumbs up my videos so fuckers like you could not downgrade them with bots. Wait, I don't, was, I don't think Arsenio was doing that before. I'm not, saying, I'm not saying he did it, but he started to talk like an idiot. He started to talk like an idiot. Now, he's fine now, which is fine. But he needs to understand there's education involved. If he has a question, he can ask me. It's again, no, no shit, I understand I agreed to violating them. No shit. That's why I'm suspended, sir. That's why I'm suspended. Con, I was told that I was suspended, not terminated, that I will be doing like, an like, appeal in October. It looks like both of you lost your accounts, I'm just saying. I already, that's what, you, are, Arsenio, have you seen me make a video? Over and over again, month after month, saying, Come on, YouTube. I didn't do anything wrong. Did I even say that I didn't do anything wrong? No. I openly said in a video that I did some, that I paid for the promotions, I screwed up, and then that was that. That's what I said. I'm a man. That's what I said. I, I manned up. I knew exactly what I did, and that's why I got suspended. Now, terminated, I thought was a little harsh. But suspended wise, no, it's not that harsh. Suspended is okay. I can I can I can take suspension. No, I won't do it because what I'll do is I'll just disable the ratings on my videos. That just takes care of everything. That's the problem. No. Disabling the ratings doesn't mean someone's a pussy. That's where you're wrong, dumb fuck. Stop trying to troll with a little fucking pussy ass team. I have a question is so no. no, okay, listen. Raining has nothing to do with negativity. Nothing. It all exists in the comments. Do you understand? Ratings are attacking people. No. Ratings are a sign of attacking. Where people will take the fucking rating, yes, and use bots to dislike it or post it on Pussy Chan and have it disliked. And when a person comes up to a video with a pre-roll ad, the first thing they do is look at how many likes and dislikes. If it has dislikes, they won't sit through the pre-roll ad because they think that it's a sucky video. Thus, when you take the ratings off, then people will sit through an ad and wait for it because they don't know what it is. The, the best they can do is look at the comments. And on some bad rated videos, you see some good comments. What do you mean that's what you think about? That's exactly what it's all about. The rating system wasn't designed for bots. It wasn't designed for hate on a level to attack the video content owner. It wasn't designed for that. Yes, it happens. And guess what? The wonderful thing is, it's called disable ratings. Much like blocking someone on YouTube. You sit there and you think that I'm stupid. You sit there and you think that just because someone does something, that they're pussies or that they're... The, yeah, it's their fucking channel, dude. 
they do what they want. It's their channel. As long as it's not bullying anyone or slandering someone or harassing someone, it's their channel. They can do what they want. <sighs> what do you mean I don't do that? You mean I didn't do that? I don't do that because I haven't had a channel in almost uh, five months now. Actually, it's three, three days past four, four months, so going on five months. No, I don't harass anyone. They harass me. And you sit there and you think that it's a game? Why don't you put yourself in my shoes of the past and start getting harassed? And start getting people emailing you. Because it's not a game. It's not a game. <sighs> yeah? And guess what? If it's a game to you, then keep it to yourself. Don't try to involve others who don't want to play your game. That is when it calls for harassment. Do you understand me? When people don't want that shit, they have to have it. Hey, Arsenia, what did you do to them? This, is it just because of one comment? This... Ryan Arsenio, is this because of one comment about Machinima? Or is there more that started this? He's trying to he's trying to poke into business that's none of his business. I don't even know what the hell he's talking about. But when he's talking about business type related things towards somebody who doesn't even want to hear it, that's when I step in. Because she obviously doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about. And he's threatening her. Wait, what is he doing to threaten her exactly? Saying that she's not going to be around. And you know what? That stops right now. Might it be some negative predictions? That stops right now. Yeah, you're threatening. By saying to some innocent girl on YouTube that someone's not going to be around, no, that's called threatening them. That's when I Negative step in predictions. and keep you around. And it's not a good guess. That person that you're threatening will be around for a long fucking time. You want to start you want to start getting fucking smart with me asshole? Do you want to get smart? I have a feeling that you are one of the fucking big time haters, you motherfucker. And if I find that you are, I'm going to fucking put a hole in your fucking head with my fist. You understand me? Yes, I will. I protect my brother, I protect my family, and I'll fucking beat the shit out of you. Now you shut your fucking mouth about the presence when it comes to these individuals, you stupid little bitch. Yeah, I do. I threaten them a lot when they fucking get in my business or other business. Just shut your fucking mouth. This is not a fucking game. No, it's not a game. When your face is bleeding, it's not a game. When you turn 18, when you turn 18, you let me know. You and I are going to fucking dance. Where do you live? What state do you live in? We're going to fucking box. You tell me what state you live in. Let's do it. Where do you live? Wait, it, it doesn't actually live in California. I'm just letting you know that. Yeah, because he's a fucking loser who thinks everything's a fucking game. Y'all only said that California because that's where I live. Do you two have each other's contacts? No. And I don't want this fucking piece of shit loser, jealous fucking loser, jealous, jealous of success of other people 
Then they have to turn it into a fucking game. Well, I'm going to fix that for you. So the next person you don't fuck with, they don't kill you. Are you taking karate? What? Are you taking karate by any chance? Yes. Yes. How much can you bench press? The last time I benched? Yeah. 385. 385? That was the last time. When was that? A year ago. Hmm. How long did it take you to get like that? Uh, probably a year. Year Re and a half. Real, real. Working out a lot. Um. For the most part, the other part was when I was losing my testosterone and I had to have testosterone in me. I thought there was a little bit of, not trying to be rude to bring this up, but did you, something about steroids, but that was a long. They say that steroids is testosterone and or testosterone is steroids. That's what they say. But um, in, in a way, they are, they are half right because it can be counted as a type of steroid. But if you can get them legally from a doctor, then it's not like a compound. Price with 385 compounds. to him. What happened? So you could lift me up. Yeah. Oh yeah, easily. I'm. I've been. You know. I've been wanting to. I've been wanting to be able to do that since I lost weight. I think I. I don't know if I told you I lost weight in 2006. I've been wanting to get like. I've been. I. I don't even know where, the fir where to start with. Um. Well, you start in the gym, or working out, or you get your own. Set I don't like what, Like what do I? So I just go to a. But do they give me instructions, or do I just do whatever the hell I feel like doing? I'm not even sure what, where to start. I mean, they they can train you, sure, if you, if you uh, get a like, personal trainer. Like I, really, I, I really don't know what to do. I think it costs extra. I mean, do you go to a gym or something? No, I haven't, go, I haven't gone to a gym. I, I think I should start going to a gym. But they will. They train me. Because like, uh, I've, I've been wanting to. Right. I mean, um, yeah, I, I think it should be okay, um, if you ask them, but I think it costs extra. I don't mind paying, I fit, so how long would it take me to get to where you are? Well, where I was, or where I am, I, won't, I, I kept a lot of my strength, but I lost a lot of size, because I stopped uh, eating a lot, and I stopped working out. What if I just work out a lot? I, let's say... I, how often do, would, did you work out to get like that? Um, did you do it every day? No, every Monday, Wednesday, uh, Monday, Wednesday, uh, Thursday, or Monday, Wednesday, Friday. For how many hours? Um, I was about an hour. Like Monday, like Monday wise, you do your arm, like your arms, your biceps. So you have a six pack. Yeah, I got it. At Damn. the end, though, like, if you do your abs, you have to do it, like, every day. Like, I have been wanting, I have just been wanting to do this stuff since, I, I, want, I wanted to, was it the smart decision to wait until I got really, lost all my weight and got really skinny to do this instead of doing this when I was fat? I guess so. First, I wanted to get skinny, and then I'm going to get buff. Somewhat. You've seen how skinny I am. All right, before I go, all right, before we go any further, all right, so... Arsenio, do you understand what I just told you? <laughs>